They are one of the most colorful fish in the ocean, and they have the ability to change colors unbelievably fast. And it's under neurological control, and they can go from an excited pattern, the green yellows and with the neon blues in it, right to a silver with blue, uh, a silver body with blue dots, which is I am invisible, you cannot see me phase. It's their uh, predator avoidance. And you think about looking through that gin clear water and uh, that silver would disappear in that atmosphere or in that environment. And that's one of their ways they help try to avoid predation. Well, and there, so they are, they there. are chameleons when it comes to color changes. When you ready for them? Yeah. She's a little bit bigger than we thought. <laughs> Okay, what, if you can give me a hand here and help hold it down. All right, I got the hand. You got that? Okay. <clears throat> Go ahead and get this tag in her real quick like, just like that. We got her marked with a unique serial number, and when she moves up the eastern seaboard, we'll be able to track her and know exactly where she started out. And she is 91 centimeters long. Okay, and now we're ready to put her back over the side. All right, I, you I got, got the head? head? Yes, sir. Okay. Let's see if we can go this way. All right, you, you ready? ready? Yep. There he goes. And there's one more for science. Don, I see that you, you have a log book keeping up a record of what we're doing out tagging the fish. What kind of information are you looking for? Well, there's certain pieces of information about the release of the dolphin that we really need to really give us the accurate uh, data that we are looking for in uh, plotting out these fish's movements. We need to have the length of the fish, the sex of the fish, water temperature, because uh, we know very little about the temperatures that they prefer, the exact location, latitude, and longitude of where they're caught. Plus, we gather information on uh, the sargasso grass, which is the ocean weed that you see floating at the surface out here. That's a critical element within the life of dolphins, but science is never really documented. So we're trying to gather information on the association and importance of sargassum. <music>